What's up guys, it's Mafia here and today I'm going to be showing you my NVIDIA Freestyle settings for CSGO. If you don't know what NVIDIA Freestyle is, it's a filter for games similar to Reshade but built into the GeForce drivers. For Counter-Strike Global Offensive, it can be used to lighten and sharpen the game's visuals for easier visibility while also being able to add a vibrance to the colors that make the game look better. To enable it, all you need to do is open GeForce Experience and enable the experimental features in the settings. Then, once you're in game, you just open your NVIDIA menu or press Alt F3 to set up a custom filter. Now this is in game as you already know it. A little blurry, especially if you have a stretched resolution like myself, and the colors seem dull and washed out. After playing around with the settings, I found my perfect freestyle config that has helped me improve to my visibility tenfold. I couldn't record the settings in game, so I took screenshots to share with you guys. Once you open the NVIDIA menu in game, you can choose game filters under the left side list or just press Alt F3 in game and that will bring you to where I'm at. Now you want to add these three filters to your preset. Brightness slash contrast, color, and details. Under brightness slash contrast, I have my contrast set to 30% to give a little more depth to the scene while also increasing the highlights to 20% to help with evening the scene. I drop shadows to negative 88% to help a ton in those dark spaces where an enemy could be lurking. Under color, you want to bring the tint intensity to 0% because it's not needed. But you do want to crank the vibrance up. I have mine on 90 to bring out a much richer color to my game. Say goodbye to those washed out colors. And last but not least, in my opinion the most important filter is the details filter. You want to sharpen the game some, the higher you go the better, but it makes it look a little funny over 50, so I have mine on a comfortable 30% and it really sharpens things up to help spot people far away. Clarity and HDR toning will be at 100% each to give the depth to tie everything together and you want to also bring bloom to 0% because bloom bad. Now I want to show you the before and after. After we enable our filter, we have a much richer, sharper game that looks better and feels better while playing it. Also, this is completely safe to do on your account and not considered cheating, so don't worry about a VAC ban or bans on face it and ESEA. Feel free to mess around with your settings to fine tune what works for you and let me know if this helps you in your games. If you enjoyed my video, leave a like and hit that subscribe button while you're here. With that being said guys, Mafia out.